Hey, it's -a me, Mario, and welcome back. Welcome to the Halloween special. Sorry. Huh? What do, you, what do you mean it's time for the vlog video? Look at the script. Schedule. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I guess it's the. Uh, wait, what? Make educational video for a weird bald guy. What's that? Oh, the chemistry homework! about that sorry about that <laughs> so this is gonna be something different now if you guys realize you guys remember a long time ago I did a, a move a book review for class because it was a project thing I don't know it was stupid but um, I failed at that one but this is chemistry and I have to do a lot of work for this so I have my good flannel on and if you guys realize I do wear flannels throughout my most of my videos but this is a different one I've been having. Now this is a blue one. I have, I have, I've been having this since I first got my two flannels. But this means no bad words, all educational, and all good. Me, okay? I can't curse or anything. This is gonna be presented in my class, so that means I'm gonna act normal on camera, on video. When you guys are seeing this, but I'm gonna be cringing in my desk right now, head down. Okay, get the smart people glasses on, and let's do the video. So what's an educational video without some cheesy background music? Okay, so, Floyd, what is that? Well, it is actually an element on a periodic table. Oh, I know, right? Now, it is actually, the, it has the atomic number of 9. Now, what does that mean? It's something. <laughs> but that also means it is the ninth number. It's like technically the ninth element on the periodic table. So when you go to the periodic, periodic table, you go to number 9, and boom, it's my element, Floyd. And it also has the atomic number of 18.9984. And you have no idea how hard it is to remember that off camera. Now, fluorine is, I think that's how you say it. Okay, I'm sorry if I'm not saying it right. Okay, if I'm getting someone irritated by not saying it right, just kill me. But fluorine is actually an interesting element discovered by, no, discovered in 1886, if I'm right. I'll fix it in editing if it's not. It was found in 1886 by a guy named Henry Morrison. And yes, I went on Google and on everything else from text to speech. <coughs> on text to speech. And it said Henry Morrison. It's like Porson. But with the M. Morrison. So fluorine compounds, as in sodium fluoride, are actually most common and mostly is also the one of the main ingredients of toothpaste and drinking water to prevent tooth decay. Dentist approved. Wow! Wow! That's incredible! There's actually something in your refrigerator that actually has one of, and one of the main elements of it. It's another compound thing. One. It's one of the main elements. It's actually fluorine. And it's called Freon. Freon is something that you put in your refrigerator tubes. And if you all know, the refrigerators actually have tubes. And they go all around, you know, doing wibbly wobbly. There's a picture right there if you want to see it. And what this actually do is that once the Freon, once the Freon actually goes inside the fridge and moves around, that's what that what makes the fridge cold. I know, I'm magically moving. The power of video editing. Well, I know what you may be thinking. Well, where can I find this thing? Am I allowed to buy this? How much does it cost? 1985. dollars plus tax and shipping and handling. Well, no, you stupid idiot. You can't get this anywhere. You can't buy this. But you can find it. See, the main, the main places where you can actually find this element is actually is Mexico, West Europe, and China. And you can mostly only find it in clay, rocks. It's, it's like you can find it in the Earth's crust with rock, clay, and coal. And it also has this thing. I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. That number you see right there, that's what we call in the scientific world, an element configuration. That was hard to say. You have no idea how many times I have to retake this video to say that. But yeah, this, which I am not saying, is technically what is what the element is actually made of. 
I think I got all the key points down for this project, so I'm pretty sure I don't have to do any more. And I want this video to just end already, but I'm gonna leave off with one fun fact. <laughs> Fluorine is actually one of the main elements that can actually uh, destroy a um, diamond or like attack it. Wow! Wow, that's incredible! Yeah. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you are new to the channel. If this is the classroom, shut up about this video. You never saw this. The teacher can teacher can remind it because he graded it, but the rest of you guys, just shut up, okay? Don't ever bring this up again. I swear to God. But yeah, as always, guys, see you guys in the next video. You stay, I'm not gonna finish that last part because it's cringy. Whatever is talking, you shut your trap. Otherwise, your booty will get a slap. Oh, the weather outside is frightful, but the.